Today on Thai Caliente, we're going to be making a Mexican lentil soup, also known as sopa de lentejas. Hi guys, I'm Renee Fuentes and welcome back to my channel, Thai Caliente. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I'd really appreciate it. Today I'm going to show you guys how to make a popular Mexican soup and that is called sopa de lentejas. So we're gonna be making a lentil soup. It's a very easy um, kind of traditional soup, but similar to sopa de fideo, um, lentils are going to pack in a lot more protein instead of the fideo noodles. And for more um, immune boosting properties, I'm gonna be using um, bone broth, um, chicken bone broth instead of just regular chicken broth. If you needed to make this soup vegan or vegetarian, then go ahead and use um, a vegetable broth or stock. And then we're gonna use our mixture of tomato, onion, and garlic. So the exact same mixture that we use for albondigas, fideo, as well as Mexican rice. Um, so like I said, this is a pretty simple dish. Um, so let's go ahead and get started on the re recipe. We are going to start off by blending half of a white onion as well as some Roman tomatoes and one clove of garlic. And to that you're going to add one cup of chicken broth or vegetable stock, whichever you prefer. And go ahead and give that a good blend. This is going to be our tomato sauce mixture that we're going to add to the soup. Then you're going to need one cup of dried green lentils. Make sure you wash and rinse them well. Add them to your soup pot along with four cups of chicken stock or vegetable broth. I, as I mentioned, I'm using bone broth for some immune boosting properties. I did not get a low sodium one, so it was a little bit too salty for my preference, so I ended up adding a little bit of water. Once you've added all of your broth, go ahead and bring the mixture to a boil for about 10 minutes. During that time, you're going to get one large potato and peel and dice it. Then add the tomato mixture that we blended into the soup along with the diced potatoes. Now I'm also going to add a handful of cilantro. This is a pretty big handful, so if you don't care for the taste of cilantro, then you can also tone it down. Um, but this is going to boil into the soup, and once it's done boiling for about 15 minutes, you want to check to see that the lentils are soft and the potatoes have softened as well. When you're serving the soup, you can remove the cilantro stems or just leave it in like I do. Go ahead and serve the sopa de lentejas into a bowl. I like to give it a squeeze of lime for some brightness as well as some fresh cilantro on top. If you guys like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. If you have any comments, go ahead and leave them below. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you guys and have a wonderful day. Bye.